basically electroscope is a device okay electroscope is what it is a simple apparatus or you can say a simple device which detect the presence of charges right what it does it detects the presence of charges detect the charge on a body in a gold leaf electroscope so simple kya hai electroscope device used to detect what electric charges consist of a vertical metal rod housed in a box now suppose this is your electroscope device which is made up of a box here you have a metal rod right and this metal rod why we are taking metal rod because metals have free electrons right always metals loses the electron so they have the free electron so we are using these metal rod which is connected with a metal knob above this rod we have a ball like structure called as metal knob okay now what happen guys when you bring the charged body near the rod near this knob from this knob the charges are transferred through the metal rod and reaches to the bottom where you have kept a gold leaf right what is here here is a gold leaf right and what happen as since the metal rod experiences the same charges then what happen same charges ripple each other so what you have seen you have seen that the gold leaf started separating with each other this is all about the apparatus consist of a metal rod housed in a box with two thin gold leaf attached to its bottom end when a charged touches the metal knob at the top of the rod the charge flows on to leaf and they diverge the degree of divergence in an indicator the amount is an indicator of the amount of charges to jitna zyada wo ek dusre se diverge honge jitna zyada wo ek dusre se separate honge utna zyada hum bolenge charge ki intensity hai okay see here this is the metal rod right and this is the electric knob metal knob when you apply a charges right then what happen the charge transferred and both the leaf get negative charge and then they started separating with each other okay and the degree of separation tells you the intensity of charges so these are the simple concept okay maybe you will get one mark question in your mcq what is electroscope what is the purpose of electroscope and all okay charging by contact now suppose here you have a uncharged metal sphere we are not taking the insulator we are taking up a metal only right and this metal sphere is what uncharged when a charged object is touched to another object the other object also get charged with same polarity due to the charge transfer now see what happen here you have a uncharged metal sphere okay once you bring a negatively charged plastic rod right near the metal sphere and you started touching this rod with this sphere now what happen this sphere get some negative charges due to this plastic rod so now what you can say this sphere gets electrified hai na jaise hi isne isko touch kiya abhi isko bhi charges mil gaye theek hai like for example if you don't want to study and some of your friend comes to your house and they said that uh, he said that okay let's complete this topic then what happened together you also have to study only you have no choice the same thing okay initially the metal sphere is uncharged but once the charged metal the charged surface the charged body bring near the metal surface then this also become charged all right due to similar charges the plastic rod get rippled now what is the third condition see when you and your friend 
started studying together okay then what happened there is a point come when when you get you know competition with within yourself okay uh, then what happened when the competition start your friend says oh he is going to study more then what happened he just say that okay okay i'm going i'm going to my house back so similarly the like charges ripple each other now charging by induction okay now let us understand charging by induction when a charge object is brought closer to another object i hope the lines are clear to everyone okay when a charge object is brought closer to another object but not touched in the previous condition suppose this is the metal rod you just this is the sphere and you touch the rod with the sphere then only the charge transfer okay in this case you just bring the two object closure you just bring the charged object closure to that the original object doesn't lose any charge and the other object gets charged as well as with opposite polarity so now what happens see this is the two uncharged metal sphere now here a positively charged metal rod you just bring near to the metallic sphere you are not touching with them okay then what happen see here here you will get opposite polarity this is positively charged okay and it induces what negatively char negative charges induces so a positive charged rod charges one sphere with negative charge the other sphere automatically get charged with positive charge am i clear to everyone yahan pe opposite ho raha hai ye ek rod hai positive charge ke sath aaya two metallic sphere hai initially when you bring near the rod near the when you bring the rod near to that sphere positive charge induces negative charge within this sphere the other sphere which is near the first sphere this is if negative this become positive so just as a opposite charge induce hote hain so when the sphere are separated the charge get distributed so this is what we called charging by induction ab exam ki taiyari ko aur behtar karne ke liye hamare channel ko like share aur subscribe karna na bhule